Where are we going? I get ice cream? <gasps> yeah, we're gonna go on a little date. We're gonna go to a used yeah, bookstore. I take with butt. No. We're gonna go to a used bookstore. And then we're gonna go get ice cream. Um, I took him out of school for the next two days. Well, today and tomorrow. Just to give him a little bit of a break. And we're gonna have a good day. Are you excited for our date? Oh. I say thumbs up. Mm -mm. You're a turd. No, I stinky. Mm -hmm. He is stinky. He's not lying. Mm -hmm. Fun day. Yeah. Fun day with my chicken head. No. No, I am phone. What am I? Your phone. I'm a phone? Yeah. Oh, I'm not a chicken head anymore? Cool. All right. You ready? Oh, my lash yeah. looks great. Coming off. Hot the water. Are you so excited? Yeah. What do you think? Yummy. Did you make that? Mm hmm. You did a good job. Does it taste good? Mm -hmm. Good. So I had to show you what I got from the bookstore, right? So it was half price books. It was an outlet store, they said. So look, $52. And let me just get them all out to show you. Girl, I got 18 books, 18 plus two kids books, but those were like 25 cents and 50 cents. Like, are you kidding me? Some of these I've never heard. Actually, pretty much all of these I've never heard of. But, like, this one I've never even heard of. The artist, artist, author, but it sounded good. Same, same. Um, I got a bunch of his books because I heard that they're really good. That, I thought, sounded familiar. Like, hardcovers for $5. Um, again, I've heard good things about James Patterson, Nicholas Sparks. Same guy, Nora Roberts. Like, are you kidding me? These were a dollar. These were a dollar. Like, yeah, they're mass produced, but like, I don't care. I just want books. So like, wow, I'm so happy. $52. It's only four o'clock, but girl, I'm done. I'm the sun. And this one wanna come off anyway, so. Well, look how clean. I have crap everywhere. I'm gonna take off my makeup. I'm about to chill. We had a fun day, you know? We went to the bookstore, went and got frozen yogurt, went to my parents' house for a few hours, came home, about to make him dinner. We're gonna chill. I'll probably read some more of my book. Right now I'm reading It Happened One Summer. Heard such good things about it. So I'm really excited. And then, you know, I already had to be read books, but now I have so many more makes me so excited if anyone ever has any book recommendations tell me tell me because i need to know i need to read all the books what is because those? my allergies are so bad like my eyes were so bloodshot it was uh, ridiculous and what is those, Mom? um like a stand kind of thing yeah so I think my hair is fine and it gets so dangly. Oh, let me see. Let me see. Oh, you look cute. I think I might wear that today. No, it's just my hat. Oh, my hair is so tangly. Oh, I just started skin cycling. I'm really excited about that. I'm hoping that, oh my God, it's so tangly. That it'll help my skin because I have like a lot of texture. Something else, yesterday I, I waxed myself at home and I had a friend tell me, because I normally use, what's the brand? Gee Gigi, Monsters. the wax off. Me, 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 swim, swim, pink, pink. The wax off, like what typically comes with it. But I had someone recommend this calming oil infused with Azulene. I don't know, but it works. Uh, Thank you so much. Uh, it works so much better. So much yeah. better. Like, I have wax all over my wax pot because I was trying to put it up one day and um, the wax spilled everywhere because I was just being dumb. But it works so good. 
and like makes my skin feel good. So you're looking for something I get that. Also, I'm trying this dry shampoo for the first time. Collab. Give me that swing. Seems fine. Give me that I just got my hair done the other back. day. And so it feels so much better. I get it to where it looks like pretty natural, I guess you could say. Taylor does my hair. She does such a good job. But anyway, I'm gonna get ready. We're gonna go to the store just to get like some random things. And today no. I'm gonna make this breakfast casserole in the crock pot that I saw um this lady make on TikTok. I'll probably put in the recipe because it's high <laughs> because it's high protein. Um, which is something that I've been looking for here recently. So, so yeah. Um, oh yeah, I'll let you know whenever we're going to the store. So now we're gonna head out to Walmart just to get a few things. At Michael's store! Yeah, we just need like some apples, just like a few things um, that I forgot to get yesterday. And yeah, we're just chilling. I might grab us uh, some lunch while we're out. I don't know. And we're gonna head to Walmart. Okay, so I'm starting the breakfast casserole like thing so what i have in there so far is a bag of simply potatoes and 180 grams of cottage cheese i was always so apprehensive to try cottage cheese but honestly it's fine um and then i seasoned salt and pepper and then she recommended using trader joe's onion salt so i'm gonna do some of that too and then she what did she say she said that she did four whole eggs and six egg whites, but I'm just gonna do this. I love this stuff. Sorry, I'm like all over the place. The egg beater Southwestern style, cause it's got like peppers and onions and, and honestly, I don't even know how much that was, but it's okay. And then I'm gonna season it a little bit more and then add some um, bacon bits and cheese. All right, she suggested adding um, 100 grams of bacon bits. I'm not really sure how much I added. And then she did like 60 grams of cheese. I just eyeballed that too. So I'm gonna put it on high for like three or four hours and then hopefully I remember to show you what it looks like. And it serves like four. So, okay, I took a shower and definitely overcooked it, but I wanna see how it turned out. It's got like the the potatoes and the eggs. This probably ain't looking good, but I bet it's going to taste good. <laughs> and it was easy and high in protein. One last thing, I think that the woman was a genius because she used the liner. She did this with soup, but I'm going to do it with everything that I cook in the crock pot. And then she stored it in her container in the liner. So it's less of a mess. Genius, I'm gonna start doing this. Yeah, I don't embarrass that easy. Well, it's kind of a lie I kind of do, but I'm gonna show you before my house in here. So this is just my kitchen <clears throat> that I have to work on. So I have all of this, gorgeous, gorgeous. I have clean dishes in here, gotta put away. Just, if you don't like clutter, dear God, the, you're probably triggered. And then also, kitchen table. We went to the store yesterday. Also, like, I don't know where to put lunch boxes when we're not using them. I don't know. So I'm gonna try to get this cleaned up.
Okay, kitchen is about as clean as it's gonna get for now. It's only like one o'clock, so we still have some stuff to do. But much better. I still gotta put that up in the cabinet, but it takes me a while. And then this, I'm still waiting to get my washing table, washing stand to put that on. Um, and then I still gotta put that stuff away. And then I wanted to show you two things. I'll I'll try to remember to put in a before photo of this. I just spray painted that yesterday and I love it. It's so pretty, so textured, and those, they're kind of funky because they've been in my car, but it's gonna look so good, so cute. And then these, I'm sure everybody knows, but maybe someone doesn't. You can take green onions and cut them down to the white part and stick them in water, stick them in a windowsill, and they'll regrow. I don't know how many times, but they grow fast and it's easy. Inch of water. It's 5.30 and I'm hanging out in bed. I'm sick, unfortunately. Oh, my voice sounds a lot better though than it did like a minute ago. I'm reading, it happened one summer. I have 150 pages left. I'm hoping to finish it by tomorrow. Um, I'm really, really liking it. Tessa Bailey is my girl. I really like her. I enjoy her her easy reads, but they're they're good, good stories. Nice smut for me. I like it. Um, but anyway, um I think since I'm on like a weight loss journey, um, I'm like about to start taking it like way more seriously than I have like the past month. Um, I need to get back into working out, but nutrition wise especially. Um so I think that uh, I might start making videos about that. I don't know. Because it'll help hold me accountable. Anyway. Bye.